to LA. All right, Manny. So where's Cowboy off to? Man, our buddy's got to spread his wings and fly, you know. He's going into the big movie star stage, so. I think he's gonna be a lead actor in a brand new action film, it sounded like, I don't know, maybe Die Hard 17 or something. <laughs> he's literally running to LA, shooting that movie, and then flying straight back out to Austin to meet us. So, just a little sw switcheroo of the flights, and your boy's there. Yeah. I feel like this thing needs a walkout song. Desperado. Oh, dang. Right around. Bro, you got it like your feet up. Oh, so, you know, in Cowboy's absence, we're going to have to take over for his spot, so I'm gonna do my best cowboy impression. What's up guys, it's Cowboy Cerrone. We're out here, rally ready driving school, right? We're gonna drive some rally cars, we're gonna drive some Can-Ams, and it's just, it's gonna be a good day with my buddies. I didn't see a yawn in there, like a really big yawn. Oh, Can yeah. you give me one of those? Oh, all right, boys, it's Cowboy Cerrone. That was good, and now why is Cowboy not here? What did he decide was important and he had to go off and go do? Man, apparently our buddy thinks that he's a movie star now, so. Uh, a gentleman named Chris Pratt sent him a text message, said he wanted him to be a co-star in a uh, Amazon movie. So we were like, that doesn't sound really important, cowboy, but you got our graces to go, buddy. Spread your wings and get it. So now, it's our turn to have fun. It's fancy bean, huh? Some guy sent to me in large bag, he said, this is good bean. I said, yeah, okay, it's me. I don't know. It's like when guys send you engine, he says, this is very good engine. I don't pull open to look, huh? I just say, okay. The pipes we didn't roll. Like, you, you want it. This is obviously going to be dramatically different from what you're used to in a car. Keep it within your means, like we were just talking about. In an off-road car, we know what the car is capable of, the driver is capable of, and we try to keep it at 80%. This is a rally car that you've never driven. Um, it's got all of, you know, 120 horsepower on a really good day, and it's hard and shit out here, so maybe dial that back a touch. Yeah. It's not going to be the most impressive thing you've ever driven. Just go have fun, go easy, uh, don't crash into things. Uh, no, you, no need to use a handbrake for anything. It doesn't do anything in these cars. Handbrakes are cheater buttons for rally cars. There's, there's, there's much we can learn long before you ever need to touch the handbrakes. So don't worry about that. Uh, most importantly, you can die. Please don't. We're gonna do three laps around a course out there. It goes basically down our runway, uh, loops into the infield. It's a quick little S turn. It's about a one minute lap plus or minus. We'll do three laps a piece. Now, if Dustin's in my way, can I pass him? Well, we've got one car, so your job so is definitely, definitely. <laughs> finger hit uh, control, but this finger wants you to hit A. Alt. We're gonna, this is control A, we're gonna select all, and then right here we're gonna hit the delete button of everything he just said. Yeah. We'll just throw all that out, and we'll start from scratch. So we're not yeah. approaching the corners this like this. Wow, that's, that's what I was gonna say, the only thing is, that holds something on the track is the rev lever when you're in the right corner. This is like, like, it looks like me trying to do UFC stuff. Yeah. I'm like, oh no, I just kick people and stuff. I don't know, and then hug them, and then sweat a lot, and then yeah. I get my neck broken, and that's the end of that. Yeah, so we're just getting out here to do a little practice, and everybody knows it takes 10,000 times in 10,000 hours to get really good at something. So Cowboy's out gallivanting with his famous buddies, playing pretend is basically what he's doing. And we're out here just putting in the time, just putting in the hours in the rally car. So Cowboy, you can just consider yourself smoked when you get here, because your boy's putting in the 10,000, if you know what I'm saying.
looks like uh, now that we got our laps in, old Texas Dave What's happening back there? from Rally Ready he's School is showing up. So now he's so going to show the boys. The he wants to join the 35 second club. You know what I mean? It's going to be a prestigious a club, though. Corner? Real prestigious. I mean, only the best of the best make it. It's not quite as prestigious as the 1020 club. No. But the 35 club, so it's, way it's out up there and, with yeah, them. So, so like, let's see what he's got. Like horses you this way. What's up, guys? Cowboy Cowboy Cerrone. Cerrone. So, if there's any of you guys that own a couple X3s, or well, my manager just took off on the track in a brand new Dodge TRX or Ford Raptor, they got a Ford Raptor, Raptor track. If you guys have any toys and you're like, where do we go? What do we do? Yep. Well, Uncharted Playgrounds has a website you go on offering playgrounds around the country. Go on the website, check it out, see where you can take your toys and get funky. It's like Airbnb for going to off-road playgrounds. So if you want to find out where to ride, when to ride, Uncharted Society's website, Uncharted Playgrounds on Instagram, and we're out here in Austin, Texas. You guys brought a couple bikes down. Oh yeah. We're about to shit and get. Now we get to go have fun. So we got here yesterday, Cowboy had to go shoot a movie. Movie star. Movie star, big boy had to go do bigger things, you know what I mean? <laughs> he came down here with just us play kids and decided we're gonna ride today. We did rally cars yesterday out here, booked that, had a freaking blast, learned how to drive those. But we like a little more speed, a little more sketchiness, and today- A lot more sketchiness. A lot more sketchiness. See if we can get a little two-wheel rocking today. Man, if you ain't biking, you ain't trying. So today is our time to play. I'm driving one of uh, S3's, <laughs> I'm driving one of S3's X3's. Oh my God. <laughs> Riddle? A rental for Cowboy? A rental for, and I got the return the keys only policy. Yeah, what it. happened last time you took a rental from uh, from the shop? Uh, that wasn't around, that was my bike. Uh, <laughs> what club did you join? Oh, uh, the 1020 club. Yeah. For all you people watching, you know what a 1020 club is? It's when you take a 1,000cc uh, motor and got to bore it over 20. <laughs> because. Oh, <laughs> uh, well, what had happened was I seen you guys were hopped up, uh -huh. and I knew the only real way to do that <laughs> was a submarine my bike. That way, no questions asked, I'd get a bigger motor. No more 1020 kits for his Outlander, but today we're trying to keep him from 3000 kitten a uh, X3. So hopefully he can keep it on the wheels. Is that why you brought him down to Texas, keep him out of the water? Yeah, out here it's dry, hot, and dusty, and just rally courses, so he can't sink anything out here. Well, Give well, him a minute. <laughs> well, there is a pond. <laughs> motor big turbo kit big radio big fun it's the full experience in this one when you show up you know it's gonna be a ride with me <laughs> I'm not promising nothing no guarantees no guarantees y'all sign the waiver that's it
Dom, how was it, man? Hey! <laughs> he kept his hands up like he was in a roller coaster ride the whole time. <laughs>